All right, take three on trying to make this video. See, uh, when you got your lab at home now, you got your little test kit. Making do with what you got. And you got teenagers, 16 year olds that are loud and come, uh, even if they're just trying to come say hi to you, they, they can spoil a whole video. Anyways, we're talking about this six pin, I mean, not the six pin, the 24 pin, also flustered. Uh, trying to get this ice giant business. If I can get this lighting right, let's see. What are we talking about? We're talking about this uh, next to the RAM. You got the 24 pin motherboard connector and the ice giant because it hangs over so far. It crushes that uh, motherboard power connector, the 24 pin. So, yeah, notice it doesn't even, my rip jaws, no problem with clearance for those. It's a damn uh, 24 pin. So, yesterday, I ordered this little guy. And actually, I don't know how, how Amazon got it here in one day, but they did. And these things are only a couple dollars. And I bet if Ice Giant bought these in bulk, they could probably get them for like, Probably 99 cents or something. I don't even I don't even know. But anyway. So for you guys that don't already have some uh motherboards that have a sideways connector, which I don't see why all motherboards in this day and age would have a sideways connector, but this X470 Tai Chi, despite being a high-end and modern motherboard, it is uh got a up uh, vertical connector. So, anyway, this should solve the issue. I bought one of these for myself, and I bought one for the test kit. Since they're so cheap, I'll just go ahead and include it for you guys. And when you guys don't break your cables off of your power supplies, it's ridiculous. It's just these little things that can make a whole lot of easy. Where before there was grief, now there is ease. So, while we're at it. I'll show you guys what I'm talking about as far as how this thing goes together. Now, the only pain in the ass thing is I got to do, so I got to pull both of these fans off. I pretty much had to take my graphics card out so that I have more room to get my big old hands in there. But uh, in order to get to the mounting um, bolts, which are these guys right here, you got you got to totally take these fans off. So, yeah, that's four more screws that I got to get out, but that's okay. I'll just take them out. I already loosened them up. So. And then I'm going to have to take the cooler totally off. But that's cool because that gives me a chance to check to see how well this cryo knot has spread under here. You know, they include cryo net knot with the. Um, finished product and Ice Giant was nice enough to send a bulk crown out, a big old tube of it for uh, our little Peter pass around testing with this cooler so I thought that was pretty cool this is all kind of goodies this is a cleaning kit it was really nice so I got both of the bolts exposed. I'm about to start another video, but let me pause this one while I uh, take this cooler off. Because I ain't got enough hands. If I was an octopus, I could probably do all this. And uh, anyway, I want to see how well that temp spread. And the reason why I'm curious is because there are only two. Um, there are only two screws that fasten this thing down now i would imagine it's probably pretty flat but you never know so we see you in the next video when i get this thing off bye drop the phone right on the motherboard oh god